On this Tuesday morning, I visited polling locations in Powhatan and Henrico County, and now here in Richmond at Thomas Jefferson High School, these polling workers tell me only a handful of voters are actually showing up to vote in person. <laughs> <laughs> they stand on separate sides of the political spectrum. It's, it's good to talk to someone who has an opposing view and listen. Okay. Julie Bateman, a Democrat, and Sue Taylor, a Republican. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, I expressed to Julie that it just it's good to hear somebody on the other side, because often we do surround ourselves with people who think the same way we think. These volunteers greet voters outside the Huguenot Public Safety Building in Powhatan County on a slow primary Tuesday. It's been light. I'm surprised. Yeah. I, when you think it would be busiest between 6 and 8, and there hasn't been. What, there's been, how many people here? A I'd dozen? Under 20. The big race here, the Republican leading House District 5. Both Bob Good and John McGuire have raised more than $1 million. Good, who is chair of the Freedom Caucus, is very conservative, uh, is running against John McGuire, who's endorsed by Donald Trump, largely because Good had earlier said he would prefer DeSantis to Trump, and now the Trump people are on this kind of revenge tour, you might say and they have a good chance of actually taking him out. At Tuckahoe Elementary School, just 40 voters cast their ballot by 9.30 a.m. In the U.S. Senate race, Democrat Tim Kaine is running for re-election, and five Republicans are running for the chance to take him on. Former Navy veteran Hung Kao, attorney Jonathan Emmert, businessman Eddie Garcia, former Senate and Ron DeSantis aide Scott Parkinson, and attorney and former Marine Chuck Smith. One voter told me he cast his ballot for Kao. A lot of people voted early, probably. Both Sue and Julie yeah. urge you to show up. No matter who you decide, the thumbs up. It's a wonderful opportunity we have in our free country. We need to be informed to keep those freedoms. And Sue, I, I can't say it better. Good job, Sue. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just come on out and vote. Make your voice heard. It's an important time. Our CBS 6 political analyst, Dr. Bob Holsworth, says the average Virginian may not really be paying attention to the primaries right now. Summer is right around the corner after all, and so he says those who are showing up to vote are very passionate about the results in November. In Richmond, I'm Brendan King, CBS 6 News.